Hi, this is John with BrockWorks. This is a follow-up tutorial to the using Profile Builder 2 uh, assemblies where we created an interior railing assembly that had this uh, null post and these uh, half-inch square balusters with boot, boots at the bottom and a uh, 60-10 oak can rail in between. And uh, so the first one we showed about uh, the first video, we went through how to create this assembly and, uh, and model along a path. In this case, I want to talk about using quantifier so that we can see how much this railing is going to cost. I'm a builder. I want to know how much these things cost. Plus, I want to see something looking cool in the model. So uh, the quantifier is a great tool for that. So um, if I've, I've opened up the quantifier, this is the icon right here. And I opened up quantifier right now. Nothing is selected. So if I choose this null post, I've assigned a cost of $133.59 for this box null. You just put that dollar amount in, hit the checkbox, and it's good to go. Um, then the uh, balusters, the half-inch balusters, are $5.37 each. These boots cost me $1.39 each. And then for the railing, we're going to do that on a cost per foot basis, and we're going to use the layer dollars icon right here. If I click on that, uh, the railing, if I click on my, excuse me, that is on the layer called A01 railings. So when I go over to layer dollars, I want to choose the layer A01 railings, and I'm going to say it's $3.70 per foot. Okay, so now when we go back over into our profile builder, um, excuse me, our assembler, we'll go ahead and draw a section of railing now that we've assigned those costs. And we're just going to go around that same one we did before. You'll notice that as it's drawing there that there's not a baluster in the middle of that null post because we, we uh, created our assembly to avoid that. So it should be a nice accurate count. Okay, we'll end it right there. Then when we click on that group that we just created, and we'll close the assembler for a second, we can see that that railing system right there in materials alone is $1,640. So now not only do I have a cool looking model of a railing, I know how much it's going to cost. Thanks for watching.